Hey, this is Dr. Jack Wolfson, the paleocardiologist of the Doctors Wolfson, and today I want to talk to you about natural ways to treat atrial fibrillation. Now, first off, atrial fibrillation is a cardiology diagnosis. It's a heart diagnosis. It's an irregular heart rhythm where the heart fibrillates or the top part of the heart, the atria, just kind of quivers and shakes. And with atrial fibrillation, it gets more common as we get older. Clearly, there's reasons for it, and those reasons are the same as pretty much what causes all disease, and that's poor nutrition and environmental pollutants and lack of sunshine and lack of sleep. It's a lack of living the healthy lifestyle. Now, the problem with atrial fibrillation is that a couple things. Number one, it can cause symptoms such as shortness of breath. It can cause lightheadedness or dizziness. It is a serious medical diagnosis. The other thing is, is that in some people, they have a higher risk of stroke with atrial fibrillation. So make sure to talk with your doctor about anything that I'm discussing in this video to decide if it's the right plan for you. But the reality is, is that atrial fibrillation in the medical world, they treat it with dangerous pharmaceuticals, some of which you have to be hospitalized before you can safely be on those. And you have to be hospitalized because they have to monitor you to make sure you don't die from the drug. Now, there's other drugs that they use that are more common that they can use on an outpatient basis, but those are not very successful. There's a procedure that they do called a cardioversion where they zap your heart back to normal rhythm, and that is not very successful either. And then ultimately, they'll go towards a procedure called an ablation where they burn the tissue in the top part of the heart, and that is successful 50% of the time in co according to the medical literature, and that's with the best doctors in the world that are doing that procedure. So let's talk about how we can prevent and actually get rid of a lot of cases of atrial fibrillation by giving the body what it needs. First off, I want to talk to you, paleo nutrition, eating the foods that our ancestors consumed, loaded with omega-3s, loaded with vitamins and minerals, organic responsible paleo foods. Number two, get sunshine. The sun gives us the energy, it fuels the body, fuels the ATP, and when you have good energy coming in from the sun, you charge up those mitochondria, you make all the energy in the cell, and you do some incredible things, and the body just works normally. I've seen this in my patients. You crank up levels of vitamin D, and with high levels of vitamin D, you reduce the risk of atrial fibrillation. Number three, get your sleep. When you're not sleeping, all bad things happen. Our ancestors went to sleep with the sun down and they awoke with the sunrise. So get your sleep, sleep, sleep your way to resolving atrial fibrillation. Number three, number next, I'm sorry, number four is get adjusted. See your chiropractor. Your chiropractor restores neurologic balance to the body, the balance of the autonomic nervous system or the parasympathetics and sympathetics. The doctor of chiropractic is uniquely skilled in removing what's called vertebral subluxations by using the spine to adjust the nervous system. Chiropractic, we get tremendous results when I work in conjunction with a chiropractic. And then also getting away from chemicals. We know that environmental pollutants and environmental toxins and air pollution and heavy metal toxicity, all those things are linked to atrial fibrillation. So get that out. And then lastly, but not least, number six, use evidence-based supplements. Omega-3 supplementation, magnesium, potassium, taurine. There's a lot of different things that I use very successfully in my practice to help with atrial fibrillation prevention and reversal. So we don't need to go down the dangerous medical route. Work with a holistic doctor. Find a local doctor of chiropractic and get healthy today.